Welcome to the Albuquerque Balloon Fiesta on the day of the annular solar eclipse. This is a truly unique event that is happening here this year. And so I've been here since 3.30 a.m. this morning to show you the events of this particular fiesta, which is a unique experience. And we started off with a beautiful drone show. Then we had um, Dawn Patrol went up. Beautiful conditions for Dawn Patrol. We had the national anthem and an exciting flyover. And then the first wave of balloons started lifting off at the 7 a.m. mass ascension. And then unfortunately the winds picked up a little later, so not as many balloons went up in the air. The second wave, I think, had to stay grounded because of the winds. And now we are awaiting the balloon glow to accompany the solar eclipse, and the Weather Channel is here, along with many other entities interested in astronomy, such as NASA. I got to meet Jim Cantori, the storm chaser. He is presenting here live for the Weather Channel, so it was very exciting. This is a first of a kind event. Everybody is gathered around in the field with their glasses, prepared to see the annular solar eclipse. It's already started to cover up uh, by the moon a little bit, and I tried to capture it with my camera. I even tried putting my little glasses over my camera lens, and it didn't work, it's still too bright. So I'm gonna try again as we get closer to the event. And I was busy posing with my glasses and I almost missed the Star Wars crew that just walked by. They're all on hand, stormtroopers and all, for this eclipse. This is a very, very unique experience here on the field to see so many people gather here today for the eclipse. It's definitely getting colder and it's getting darker. During the annular solar eclipse, the height of the eclipse, we're going to have a candlestick glow. It is too windy for the balloons to inflate. So they call it a candlestick glow when all the balloons, uh, the baskets, light their burners all at once like candlesticks of propane fire. So that's what we're going to see. And as the sun's getting shaded, it is starting to get really cold. It's kind of strange because it's light, but it's a little dimmer and it's getting cold. So I'm gonna bundle up. The flames are starting. I don't know that I'm going to be able to capture it well with my camera. I'm trying, but it's not working very well. It's almost fully covered. It's a very surreal experience. the excitement it's almost here and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show it to you there it is there it is wow Woo! Well, that was super cool. I don't 
actually remember ever experiencing that. So that was a first, and it got noticeably cold here on the field. So I'm going to attempt to be back this evening to enjoy a full balloon glow experience, which I haven't been able to show you before. So I look forward to that. I'll see you later this afternoon. Folks, we've made it to the evening glow event this Saturday, October 14th, and it's a lovely evening. The winds have calmed down. It's really warm. It's like 70 degrees out here, and we have picked up some food and we decided to come to one of the beer tents to have a beer while we await the glow. And if the beer tents are full, you can look for the big Dos Equis sign. There's one on the north end of the field, there's one in the center of the field. If they're full, come down south to the Sid Cutter Pavilion. It is pretty empty, and it's a great, gonna be a great view of the field from down here as well. Folks, the evening session has started. Right as the sun is going down, when golden hour starts, the balloons start to inflate. It is so incredibly beautiful. And as it gets dark, they're gonna start to light with the burners. So enjoy. Beautiful, beautiful balloons. Okay, so for the balloon glows, there are much less crowds than there are in the morning. So you can head down to Balloon Fiesta Park around 4 to 4.30, I would recommend is a good time. You'll get a good parking space. You'll have plenty of time to get into the park, get something to eat, and possibly have a little drink, and enjoy yourself before the balloons start going up. So enjoy this balloon glow session with me today here at the Balloon Fiesta. this event is you can actually walk around and you have a little bit of breathing room it's not completely neck to neck like it is during the morning events and you can get right up close and personal to the baskets as they're burning and inflating their balloons Light up the balloons. All burn. You hear him announcing it?
for the first time ever, I see a balloon that's covered in balloons. And I haven't seen that balloon before, so I want to get a closer look. Is that beautiful? After the all glows, the night ends with a drone show and the fireworks. So I will show you just a tidbit of the remainder of the evening. Thanks so much for watching this beautiful day at the Valencia Fest.